Hello Scorpio, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot. I'm coming to do your weekly love reading from October 9th through the 16th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, share, and subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. If you would like a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. All right. What's going on for the Scorpio? Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Scorpio love reading, October 9th. All right. So it seems like you may be um, in a situation where, you know, it's like you're taking more than you're giving. Okay. So it's basically saying, the card said, allow yourself to give and allow yourself to receive. But I'm feeling somebody is just doing a little bit too much. I feel like you were doing a lot of taking. I know y'all saw that freedom card. And I feel like somebody um might have become free from you because of it. All right. And they told you. They told you that they left you because you wanted too much. Or this is the other way around. You might have told somebody that you uh, want to be free from them because they just want too many things. All right. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. All right, Scorpio. Yeah. All right, so the moral of the story is honesty. So, got to be honest going on. All right, what's going on with the Scorpio love reading October 9th through 16th, 2017 love reading. Ooh. So it seems like somebody might have came out and said either they wasn't preg pregnant, they don't want to start a new relationship, or that is not your baby. Okay. Or I could, it could be somebody lost a baby. Yeah. All right. So somebody's pregnant and they tell they told you it wasn't yours, or you told them it wasn't theirs. Okay, but this is definitely somebody's pregnant here, okay? But it's not yours. Or it's not somebody's, but I feel like somebody is going to tell them. I feel like for some of you, they might just indirectly say like, Oh, what if this baby is not yours? Would you take care of it? They say that? Yeah, it's not. <laughs> Look. They came all in a row like I feel like they should come if you're pregnant. First, you got the fertility, you're fertile, then you're pregnant, and then the baby's here. So, somebody is being honest about a pregnancy or maybe somebody needs to be honest about a pregnancy. All right, what is this honesty card about? This is crazy. What is this honesty about? So somebody could be had in a pregnancy also. Somebody could have been had in a pregnancy and waiting until they get farther along to say something. Or maybe somebody just coming out the blue to tell you like, hey, I'm pregnant and it may be yours. Or, you know, however you do it the other way around. I think I'm the father, you know. All right, October, October. Okay, so... Okay, so it seems like whenever this news come out, it's going to be a weight lifted off of you. Okay, I feel like whoever needs to be honest about something, they're going to have the weight lifted. Like maybe when they tell everybody about it or maybe when they say what's going on. Mm -hmm. Ooh, jeez. Okay, so it might be a little manipulation going on here. Now, let's see what this manipulation is about for the Scorpio. What's 
what's going on for the Scorpio? Scorpio, what is this manipulation from Scorpio? Love reading October 9th through the 16th, 2017. Shoot. Okay. So somebody might be manipulating the ex or it might be the ex's baby. Okay. All right, I got to pull one more for this. What is this unseen and this manipulation about for the Scorpio? What is going on? Mm -mm. Damn. Okay, so it seems like once all this pregnancy stuff came out, somebody decided that they didn't want to sleep with um, the other one. One of, one of you guys decided y'all don't want to sleep. I'm feeling like you decided you didn't want to sleep with your partner. But it could be the other way around. Or just like the person that you're dealing with. But it's only because you're not attracted to this person sexually anymore because you've been dealing with your ex. And I feel like the baby might be this ex's that you're attracted to and want to be with. But it's not looking too good for that. So this ex ain't going for it. Okay. All right, no, Cleo cards. I like to read these straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. All right, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Scorpio, love reading, Scorpio, love reading, Scorpio, love reading. October 9th through the 16th, 2017. Scorpio, love reading. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Scorpio, Scorpio. Wow, yeah, somebody hmm, trying to take a leap of faith on a stranger with a baby. I don't think it's going to work. All right. Anybody who knows Tarot know this is the pregnancy card. All right. So somebody is being truthful about a baby. So somebody could be telling somebody you got a baby in. Wow. All right, so somebody's pregnant and they're taking off with the person who they feel like is the father, but I don't feel like that's the father. Yeah, that's the ex. The father is the ex. I feel like you might have left him to be with somebody else. Now you're trying to go back, but it's, it's some twisted stuff going on here. Cut it out. Sorry. Sorry. All right, we got the moon here. I got to clarify this moon. What's this moon about for the Scorpio? Scorpio, Scorpio. For October 9th through 16th, 2017. What is this moon about? Mm. Wow. All right, seems like somebody getting ready to take somebody to court. and I feel like they might be getting... Okay, so let me read it, and then I'm going to read it straight out the book. So somebody is pregnant. They felt like they left to be with somebody new, and they tried to put it on the one person who they were new with, but the secret came out. But, no, it didn't come out. She's trying to hide this. Somebody's trying to hide this secret that you know, I think it only could be a she, but I don't know. It could be other way around. But it seemed like somebody trying to hide this secret situation and they being like real um, manipulative and sneaky to do it. I mean, I guess it's the same thing. The cards are saying the same thing. It's no different story. But, of course, you guys are going to end up in court about this. You know, somebody wants a test. All right. So, let's do it. We got the Empress. Impress, impress, impress me. All right, so it says, A time that you may doubt yourself or circumstances. However, new and exciting times are approaching. A time of love and sensu sensuality. Pregnancy may be indicated. So we got that knocked out. All right, so we got the staffs. Three of staffs. All right, now is the time to work on what you want don't let this opportunity pass you by others may bring you news of advancement okay all right so we got the moon the moon 
All right, and the moon is upright. It says, lies and deception confuse your options. Well, watch for friends who are, in fact, enemies. The, there is gossip surrounding the situation. Events are or will become very crazy. Okay, so it seems like somebody might get ready to tell on you. Somebody might tell on you. Okay, so I feel like, whew, I keep hearing he took it off. He took it off. He took it off. So I feel like if you're a male, I feel like you knew that she had somebody else, but you decided to take the condom off. Okay? And you think that this possibly may be your kid. All right? But I'm feeling like it's the ex-kid. I think all this stuff came out. They found out she was a liar. And I feel like they might have let her go. All right, let's 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 just keep going. All right. We got the cups. We got the cups. Queen of cups. All right, Queen of Cups reverse. A distinguished female concerned with public opinion. Slightly arrogant. Look behind. The uh, look behind the smile before extending your hand. Wow. Yeah, so this is definitely a hard one because I keep getting mixed feelings about is who's the dad. I keep saying the, the ex is the dad, but I don't know if you're the ex or not. Okay, but you, you guys know that part more than I do. But it seems like the ex is the dad. All right. So we got the judgment card. Judgment, judgment, judgment. All right. It says a time to pay what ha for has been, what a time to pay for what has been done. A time to begin again, fresh and new. The price has been paid. Now begin again. Uh, can indicate legal matters ending successfully. So it's basically like all this stuff is getting ready to blow up. And next thing you know, you're going to end up in court either getting your child or getting some money for it. All right. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you're on a personal read, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful weekend. I mean week. Sorry.